very much emily do schools need need better security protection no if so how do you better protect students in schools this is on my mind a lot with all the school shootings and threats uh no i don't think we need policing in the way it's done in our centralized education systems and our centralized education systems are emily as far as i see it are just destructive forces so uh, how do you protect students you protect them by educating them but our centralized schooling is not education so it's a it's a horrendous loop right you hire better teachers you create uh more uh learning space right set up a school where you're you're surrounded by trees not by fences right set up a school where kids can choose their own curriculum right hire educators and make sure they're not overwhelmed with 30 40 students per class that reduce your class sizes to tennis 10 10 maximum right hire bring on um uh, health care workers mental health care workers to deal with that feed students right provide good food in schools right just in case there you have students in your class that are below the poverty line or in your school that are below the poverty line are not getting good nutrition uh, provide extracurricular activities such as music sports uh, playtime going for walks in the forest uh, build community like there's so much you could do other than hiring security with guns to stand outside the doors right it's a long game it's not going to solve the problem overnight it's 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 taken decades to reach this point it's going to take at least years for us to come out of it right 